Although we know that global temperatures have increased by 0.8 degrees over the last 150 years, what really matters is how temperatures changed in different locations. We've seen the largest temperature increases in the Arctic, but in the Arctic we're seeing very large natural fluctuations on top of that long-term trend, and that makes it very difficult to detect a signal of temperature increase. However, in the tropical regions we've seen slightly smaller increases in temperature, but those year-to-year -year weather fluctuations due to El Nino, for example, are much smaller, which makes it much easier to detect the long-term trend. These temperature fluctuations are important because both humans and natural ecosystems are adapted to experiencing levels of natural climate fluctuations. It is when the temperature increases become outside those natural ranges of fluctuations that the largest impacts are going to occur. Although we'd like to give a precise year for when we're going to see temperatures consistently outside the range of past variability, we're just not able to give a precise value. We have to give a range because of these natural fluctuations. But it's also important to note in the tropical regions, because the variability is small, we're already seeing temperature changes that are well outside the past variability range. And so these changes are happening now. It's not just to worry about the future.